मेरे को आर्ट में पहले से ही बहुत ज्यादा इंटरेस्ट था आई टू ड्रॉ लॉट एंड आई टू ड्रॉ ऑलमोस्ट लाइक ऑल द टाइम एडवर्टाइजिंग में गया एडवर्टाइजिंग से इलेस्ट्रेशन का सोचा एनिमेशन के लिए गया देन गॉट द अपॉर्चुनिटी टू होस्ट द शो दिस शो रियली चेंज माई लाइफ इससे पहले तक आई वुड जस्ट एन आर्टिस्ट बट बिकॉज ऑफ द शो आई बिकेम लाइक हाउस होल्ड नेम आई हैव बीन पार्ट ऑफ यू नो और होल जेनरेशन चाइल्ड हुड थोट ऑफ पीपल ऑल्सो रिमेंबर मी एज मैड एंड नॉट एज रॉ आई थिंक द फर्स्ट स्टेप इज दैट डोंट सेट बैक स्टार्ट एंड द सेकेंड थिंग इज यू हैव टू वर्क हार्ड Welcome, sir. Thank Welcome you. to the Insta Live of Take One Digital Network. Thank you so much. Thank you, and just call me Rohit. Yeah, don't call me sir. <laughs> Very happy to be here. Very happy to be part of this live. Even we are excited because I know that uh, I've grown up watching Mad. So I think it's very nostalgic moment for me. कि मैं uh, I'm talking to you right here, and all our lovely audiences here. So it's a nostalgic moment for me. Don't say that. Yeah, that makes me feel very old. Then. <laughs> no, I think because I loved your art. I've been a big, big fan of your art. Thank you, thank you, thank you so, so much. So a very warm welcome, sir. Thank you for sparing your valuable time and talking to Take One. Thank you. Like I said, I'm very happy to be part of this. Yes, yeah, sir. So, me, so, Janna, I want to know that Rob, ki, Rob, ki creative side. कैसे शुरू आपने कैसे शुरुआत की अपनी जर्नी की एज एन आर्टिस्ट जर्नी एक्चुअली आर्ट में इंटरेस्टेड था बट यू नो आई नेवर थॉट आई वुड परसू इट एज अ करियर क्योंकि उस टाइम पे पता भी नहीं था यू नो देख एक्सपोजर वी हैव टूडे तब ऐसा गूगल नहीं था कि आप टाइप करके देख लो कि इसमें अगर फील्ड में जाना है आपको तो आपके पास क्या क्या ऑप्शंस हैं यू नो सो इट स्टार्टेड वेरी अर्ली ऑन मेरे को आर्ट में पहले से ही बहुत ज्यादा इंटरेस्ट था आई टू ड्रॉ लॉट एंड आई टू ड्रॉ ऑलमोस्ट लाइक ऑल द टाइम एंड पीपल अराउंड मी रेकग्नाइज दैट उनको लगा कि हाँ टैलेंट है यू नो ऑफ पीपल इज टू ऑफर मी लाइक सम स्मॉल टाइम जॉब ऑल्सो लाइक ओ आई नो समन एंड देर डूइंग चिल्ड्रंस मैगजीन एंड योर एलिस्ट्रेशन सो नाइस Why don't we do it? And I was just in school, and I would do that for pocket money. But I still didn't understand that I can make this uh, this as a career. So, wo bought time tak uh, aisa laga. And when you come from a middle class family, na, to aapko na sirf engineer aur doctor hi banne ke baare mein bataya jata hai. So, kabi socha bhi nahi tha ki is field mein aunga. Uh, but yeah, eventually I realized that you know this is my calling and this is what I want to do. Um, and then I I had my formal sort of. Um, education in um, art, so college of art, art joined, kia uh, bachelor's kia wahan se apna in um, uh, applied art, then an ID kia. So wahan se journey shuru hui, and then uh, basically entered this beautiful world of art. Definitely, I think your journey has been so inspiring for so many people. You have inspired me to take up art to awesome. you know, create that DIY because I used to do that at home. Awesome, and you know. Back when when I started and I started doing these things, for us it was just jugad. Because in, as Indians know, like if this box is finished, if this jar is finished, how do we use it? Because it's like, oh, such a beautiful jar, you can't throw it. So for us, for us it's just jugad only. So I started back then. Till then, this word was not even used for DIY. Now everyone says, oh, he he is a DIY artist and he does DIY. So I started back when uh, nobody even called it DIY. Yes, that that is absolutely true. In those time, pay nobody actually knew that how right. can we use these materials for creating an art, wonderful piece of art actually. Yeah. So, like sir, you said you started your journey. Now, every one of the journey, me there are some obstacles, some challenges. Come. So, in your life, me, what challenges were there, and how did you overcome them? Challenges were a lot, yeah. Right from the start, even when I wanted to enter this space, like you know, just to convince my parents like i said i come from a middle class family and my parents dream was ki dad engineer hai to mere ko doctor banna chahiye you know so even to just make them understand that this is what my calling is yeah uh, this is what i'm passionate about because parents ka ye rehta tha ki abhi aapka ek stable career hona chahiye ab bachcha khush hona chahiye aise to 
it took a, a lot to make them understand you know and the society is not accepting of it so those challenges the uh, but unke sath deal karna pada because i knew that this is what i want to do and even to just pick the right direction like uh my style was very illustrative mujhe illustrations banana bahut pasand tha and us time pe and also because i was studying uh, applied art and i was getting into advertising us time pe kuch zyada avenues nahi the jahan pe main illustration ka zyada kaam kar sakta only for like some magazines here and there but i wanted to make my own mark to abhi kya karna hai to yeah i just figuring out ki kya direction mein jana hai advertising mein gaya advertising se illustration ka socha animation ke liye gaya then got the opportunity to host the show um and um, eventually become a creative director of the show uh, make videos and create content to har ek level pe challenges the jab kuch naya seekhna tha jab kuch naya field mein jao aapko uske bare mein pata nahi hai to abhi kya karenge you know so the challenges were always there but i know what my goal was you know i know what i wanted to do and when you are sort of persistent you know or you are consistent um and you are willing to unlearn कि अभी जो भी मैंने सीखा है ठीक है इट हैज मेड मी रीच टू दिस लेवल बट इफ आई वांट टू डू समथिंग एल्स आई हैव टू अनलर्न ऑल ऑफ दिस और अभी नया शुरुआत करना पड़ेगा फ्रॉम स्क्रैच यू नो इफ यू आर विलिंग टू डू दैट एंड यू आर विलिंग टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट द प्रॉब्लम इज तो आप सलूशन ढूंढ लेते हो उसका एंड दैट हैज बीन माय माय गो टू मंत्रा कि अगर कुछ है अगर प्रॉब्लम तो उसका सलूशन भी होगा एंड यू फिगर आउट द सलूशन So, I, I think yeah. that's a very big message to all the people who want to pursue a passion, pursue karna chahte hain that you start from somewhere and you have to follow it because journey yeah. is not always going to be very easy for everyone. So I think that's a very uh, good message that you. And if it was easy, to har koi kar leta na. Bilkul. You know, it's difficult, but only a few can. It's like climbing Everest. Agar itna asaan hota, har koi betha hota upar. But there are very few, and jo log pochte hain wahan tak. उनका नाम कम्स इन लाइक हिस्ट्री बुक्स यू नो सो इफ यू वांट टू डू समथिंग जिसके बारे में लोग जाने तो आपको मेहनत करनी पड़ेगी देयर विल बी चैलेंजेस बट यू शुड हैव द द फायर इन योर बेली कि मुझे बस करना है और ये चैलेंजेस को ओवरकम करके मुझे जो मेरा गोल है वहां तक पहुंचना है दैट्स दैट्स वेरी ट्रू यू हैव टू फॉलो योर पैशन एंड उसके लिए चैलेंजेस आर इक्वली इंपॉर्टेंट टू रीच योर जर्नी So and I can see the lovely comments for you, sir, because uh, so many people are saying we love you, we we uh, miss Mad. So I think, how do you feel when people tell you like you are from the show, from the you know Mad show? So how do you feel that time? Ah, it's very overwhelming. Yeah, बहुत खुशी होती है कि इतने सारे लोग you know um, have been part of my creative journey. क्योंकि this show really changed my life. इससे पहले तक आई वॉज जस्ट एन आर्टिस्ट बट बिकॉज ऑफ द शो आई बिकेम लाइक हाउस होल्ड नेम अब सब लोग मेरे को मेरे नाम से जानते हैं मेरे काम से जानते हैं बहुत खुशी होती है एंड यू नो द थिंग इज दैट आई स्टार्टेड द शो बैक इन टू थाउजेंड फोर एंड फाइव एंड वी आर इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू एंड पीपल स्टिल रिमेंबर द शो पीपल हैव फॉन मेमरीज ऑफ द शो आई हैव बीन पार्ट ऑफ यू नो और होल जेनरेशन चाइल्ड हुड सो इट्स इट्स अ ग्रेट फीलिंग दैट यू नो जहाँ आपके बेस्ट uh, फ्रेंड्स होते हैं उसमें रॉब का भी एक नाम है मैड शो का भी एक कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन है तो इट्स इट्स अ नाइस फीलिंग दैट आई एम पार्ट ऑफ एवरीवन यू नो ब्यूटीफुल मेमोरीज एंड चाइल्डहुड और देयर क्रिएटिव जर्नी तो खुश होते हैं जिनके दैट्स ट्रू सो यू हैव डन सेवन सीजन अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल आल्सो रिमेंबर मी एज मैड एंड नॉट एज रॉब क्योंकि उनको शो इतना ज्यादा याद है कि यू आर मैड राइट इट्स अ आई एम रॉब बट इट्स माय शो इज मैड I think that's the you know that's the charm that you had that people remember you by I think by mad or by you said that that mad wale you know because yes. I was telling my friends because I they got to know that I'm going to interview you so they were telling me you know we are so excited we uh, fondly remember like the DIYs that you do and especially the big picture in the end we used to wait for that the big picture reveal of the big picture that was my favorite segment too um, not only because I enjoy working with scale, but you know, for me, I had just stepped out of um, an ID, and I got this show, you know, a big show where I could showcase my work, like on nationwide. I mean, India ke kone kone tak log mera kam dekh sakte. So, yes, so then, आपको मुझे कुछ बड़ा करना है. So, I had a segment on the show जब मैं कुछ बड़ा कर सकता हूँ. And rest of the show was where I was teaching things, but this was a segment where I could show off a little bit. You know, कि अभी मैं आपको दिखाता हूँ कि possibilities क्या हैं. 
and what I can do. So it was my favorite segment too, and especially for an artist, um, if you are given a canvas that big, you know, and supplies, कि चलो आपको जो बना रहे हैं बनाओ. It's like a dream come true, yeah. So I used to really enjoy making those big pictures. I think for artists, that's the heaven. For any yeah, artist, absolutely. So, like, of course, asking an artist, like, which is your best piece of art? But I would like to know which is your best piece of art till now that you've made. Best piece of art? That'll be very difficult to pick. Actually, yeah, it's like asking a parent, "Ki aapka favorite bacha kaun sa hai?" <laughs> Every piece of my art is like my baby. You know, but what I can say is, like I was mentioning earlier, that मुझे uh, you know I love working with scale. Like um, I love working with materials. मुझे मजा आता है you know when we experiment with materials. And even when we used to make the show, me and my whole team हम लोग बैठ के सोचते थे कि अभी कुछ नया कैसे कुछ इंट्रोड्यूस किया जा सकता है. And with every material, no, you have new challenges. Like if you're work, working with plastic bottles, or you're working with metal, you know, you're working with uh, cloth. Everything will come with its own challenges. So, fear again that whole thing of कि अभी ये problem है तो उसका solution कैसे निकाले? How you can creatively think, um, you know, and uh, figure out कि इससे क्या किया जा सकता है. So that was very exciting. So I I love working with the materials. Uh, I specialized in animation, but in that also I prefer doing a lot of stop motion animation. Again, because there I can work with materials with different objects. So all I can say is I get joy from creating things, and if I can get my hands dirty, तो जो भी मेरे सामने आता है मुझे बनाने में बहुत मजा आता है. So like you said, you can get your hands on anything, and you like to you know just get your creative mind. So like talking about your creative mind. So where do you draw your inspiration from? All around me, you know. I say this a lot कि आपके चारों तरफ देखो there's in, 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 like a lot of inspiration around me. Anything you look at, you can be inspired from that. Um, ideas, inspiration. My mantra or my motto is like observe and absorb. कि आप जब भी जाते हो कहीं बाहर, keep your eyes and ears open and look around you. You know, often enough you will see like आप कुछ uh, एक tree देखोगे या कोई एक poster देखोगे या कोई car देखोगे या कोई एक um, character देखोगे like you know somebody is just sitting by the side of the road and having chai can also give you an idea. So I say, just keep your eyes and ears open. Um, also, like the, just sitting back and waiting for an idea or inspiration to strike is a fool's game. आपको हमेशा ready रहना है. And the thing is that I feel that your brain is like a little sponge. You know, the more information you give it, वो उतना ज़्यादा absorb करता रहता है. तो आप जो भी ideas हैं collect करते रहो और उनको store करते रहो. Then that gives you a nice sort of platform or a foundation. उसके बाद because a lot of people हैं मेरे को कुछ inspiration नहीं आ रहा है. वो इसलिए भी होता है बिकॉज यू डोंट हैव इनफ कॉन्टेंट अप हियर तो ये आपको जो आपका लाइब्रेरी है उसको हमेशा फुल रखना है शुड बी फुल ऑफ बुक्स ताकि जब भी आप कुछ देखो यू कैन कनेक्ट इट टू दैट कि अच्छा मुझे ये दिखा है ना हैव दिस आइडिया आई कैन कनेक्ट इट एंड पुट इट डाउन ऑन पेपर एंड विल बिकम लाइक अ ब्यूटीफुल आर्ट पीस सो इट्स वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट लाइक फॉर एग्जांपल योर कुकिंग अगर आप खड़े रहोगे और बोलोगे मुझे पुलाव बनाना है तो ऐसे नहीं बन जाएगा यू हैव टू गेट योर राइस यू हैव टू गेट योर पीस यू हैव टू गेट योर पोटैटोस यू हैव टू गेट योर स्पाइसेस यू हैव टू गेट थिंग्स and then you can experiment and say but i want to make this kind of a pulao you know so for art is also like that when you look around you know if you already have some information you can build on that and say hey this is a great piece of um, whatever like you know inspiration for this idea so it's just that uh, i think ideas and inspiration is all around us yeah. i think that's a very good thing to say like ideas are within you you have to grasp everything from around you that's the surrounding which gives you the idea about what yeah. you need to draw what you need to paint i think that's a big message for the people who want to pursue uh, their career into uh, as an artist so like you said your journey has been difficult like your father had a different profession so now you tell me like people are still reluctant to follow their passion as an artist as a painter or maybe in a creative field so what message do you want to give to them just start you know like that's that's very very important um i know like people are like you said reluctant or scared ki kya hoga aage i mean kisi ko nahi pata hai like even if you become a doctor you don't know aage kya hoga you know there are enough engineers and doctors all around but we also need visionaries you know we also need artists we also need designers you know so 
इट्स इम्पॉर्टेंट टू स्टार्ट वो पहला स्टेप लेना बहुत ज्यादा इम्पोर्टेंट है इफ यू नीड टू रीच समेर इफ यू जस्ट सिट बैक एंड से मुझे वहां जाना है नहीं होगा यू हैव टू टेक दैट स्टेप अभी आगे आपका जर्नी कितना डिफिकल्ट है वेदर दे आर हर्डल्स वेदर दे आर ऑब्स्टिकल्स वेदर दे आर चैलेंजेस वो आपको फेस करने पड़ेंगे जब टाइम आए एंड आई फील दैट इन टूडेज टाइम टाइम इट्स मच ईजियर यू नो बिकॉज देर आर दिस लॉट ऑफ एक्सपोजर थैंक्स टू द इंटरनेट Uh, there are enough platforms that are very supportive um you know so anyone can easily build a career build an audience build their community or tribe abhi agar aap ek painter ho you don't need to book like a big uh, hall to exhibit your paintings you know you have instagram to put up your work if you are a content creator video maker if you want to tell stories your animation or movies you have platforms like youtube you know where you can put up your short videos and you can build an audience around it um brands will recognize you if you have good work so i think the first step is that don't sit back start and the second thing is you have to work hard you know if you have to reach somewhere you have to work hard there are no shortcuts and when you're putting yourself out there i say this that it's very important that you show what is uniquely you you know when you have a personal story and a personal uh reflection in your work of your life of your story people connect to that to aapka kya personal story hai aap apne kaam mein usko dalo taki people can connect to that story and that makes you unique and that will make you stand out see your work should always have some sort of a take away because aapko koi apna time kyu dega whether you are putting up a painting whether you are putting up a video whether we doing this live there has to be some take away from this so you need to know your audience and you need to know what you are offering is it your personal story is it some sort of inspiration is it motivation is it how are you helping them are you entertaining them are you educating them what's the objective of your work and um, what your audience wants you have to keep all these things in mind but the first thing is start karo baitho nahi because you will learn along the way you know it's like learning on the job wala scene you will learn so don't sit back if you are really passionate about it just go for it yes that's the mantra that you have if you want to do it just go go for it and follow your passion absolutely and logo ko lagta hai ki you know abhi art mein career nahi hai ye nahi hai what if i fail so what you know you are so young you are allowed to make mistakes you know when you are in your 20s when you are in your or like till even 25 you are allowed to make mistakes because this is the time where you are exploring and learning when you come to my age then it's become becomes difficult to make mistakes you know kyunki ab aapki life bahut zyada set hai sorted hai to ab aapke paas itne options nahi hote when you're younger you can make mistakes and you can learn from them so it's important to risk and uh, you know take decisions jo aapko lagta hai ki you know bigger risk will be uh, uh, more rewarding is that like a bigger the risk bigger the reward to risk lo dekho try karo agar mistake hoti hai learn from it move on and try something else you know that's true so so you are saying that when you come to my age but i don't think that you've aged since i uh, started watching <laughs> you are kind thank you <laughs> so i i think everybody i think all the audience can agree to the same thing because you look exactly the same i used to watch you on the tv show so i think nothing has changed so what is the <laughs> secret behind uh, i'll this? give a very cliche answer it's, it's the love um that i get from everyone and 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 the joy i get from doing what i am absolutely passionate about you know i say i love what i do and i do what i love and that that's what keeps me happy and i guess that shows on my face so like sir when you started uh, the show on the television so there were not many avenues that you can portray your art it was just limited to television right now we have so many avenues for the social media and you've also started your uh, youtube journey so tell me how is that journey going for you it was again very challenging very difficult um, when i left television i wanted to transition into youtube because i realized that the audience was shifting to a more digital sort of medium i realized digital was big and it was booming so i wanted to get into that but um, difficult tha yaar because when i started i started the channel and even when i was shooting it was very television like to wo television ka hangover tha thoda 
कि देवर थ्री और फोर कैमरास एवरीथिंग हैज टू बी लाइक द प्रोडक्शन क्वालिटी हैज टू बी ग्रेट um the even the way i used to speak to my audience was very different um because for television lines are scripted because you have to keep it in like if it's a half an hour show you have to shoot 22 or 23 minutes of content beech mein wo spaces rahega for ads so everything has to be time bound so aapko ek script rakhni padti hai you can't just keep like talking like now our life can be half an hour our life can be one hour we have the liberty and freedom because we are running this when you're working with a television channel everything is very controlled so i came from that kind of a background because i did it for almost a decade but then i realized that you know youtube or this space is a lot more intimate a lot more personal people want to connect with their creators so aapka language bahut alag hai jis tarah aap baat karte ho you know it's more spontaneous more personal even the way they consume the content they are so close you know like when you're watching it on like a phone screen it's not like एक लिविंग रूम में बैठ के आपका बड़ा टीवी लगा और उस पर आप बैठ के देख रहे हो दिसकनेक्ट बट हियर द ऑडियंस इज एंटरिंग क्रिएटर्स लिविंग रूम कि ये लोग अपने घर में शूट कर रहे हैं वेरी बिग डिस्कनेक्ट जो मुझे थोड़े टाइम बाद रियलाइज हुआ सो फॉर मी इट वॉज स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम स्क्रैच आई वेंट एंड आई थॉट माई पॉपुलरिटी फ्रॉम टीवी विल मूव टू डिजिटल और सडनली मेरे मिलियंस ऑफ फॉलोअर हो जाएंगे बट ऐसा कुछ हुआ नहीं I kept putting content out, but कुछ भी work नहीं कर रहा था माई फॉलोअर काउंट वॉज नॉट ग्रोइंग एट ऑल आई थिंक अराउंड फिफ्टीन हंड्रेड एटीन हंड्रेड सब्सक्राइबर्स आई हैड एंड वॉज इन ग्रोइंग ओनली एंड देन लाइक आई सेट जब मुझे दिखा कि प्रॉब्लम है एंड आई वॉज लाइक नाउ टू स्पेंड टाइम टू आइडेंटिफाई कि एग्जैक्टली प्रॉब्लम क्या है ताकि मैं उसका सोल्यूशन दूँ एंड देन आई फील आउट द सोल्यूशन आई फाउंड आउट दैट दिस इज वॉट आई नीड टू डू टू करेक्ट विद माई ऑडियंस एंड देन स्टोली वी स्टार्ट इट ग्रोइंग एंड नाउ वी हैव अ ब्यूटिफुल कम्युनिटी जिनके साथ मैं इंटरेक्ट कर पाता हूँ एंड दैट्स द ब्यूटी ऑफ दिस मीडियम की अभी इतने अच्छे कॉमेंट्स आ रहे हैं इंस्टेंटली आप वीडियो डालते हो तो आपको लाइक्स दिख जाते हैं कॉमेंट्स दिख जाते हैं आप अपने फॉलोअर्स से ऑडियंस से बात कर सकते हो सो इट वॉज अ डिफिकल्ट ट्रांजेक्शन आल से बट इज बीन क्वाइट रिकॉर्डिंग you can directly connect to your uh, audience to your uh, uh, followers and talk to them see their views what they want to actually see you you know you can you know take their ideas inspiration from them so i think that's the biggest challenge uh, or you can say a transition that you've seen yeah and it's important also like when i was doing youtube i realized this new platforms are coming up the new apps are coming up like your instagram and your and i was like okay let me see what people are doing here and for me when i joined film making i thought i'll make animation films and films are like 3 hours long ek ghanta you know i moved to television which was half an hour show you know i moved to uh, youtube which was like 10 minute videos 5 minute videos to now instagram is like 15 second 30 seconds so content ka jo aapka uh, format hai wo itna change hota raha hai hota ja raha hai but like i said you should be willing to unlearn and learn you know to uh, stay relevant you know you, you should be like a um, like a chameleon you know ki aapko kuch bhi ho to aapko adapt karna hai uske sath tabhi aapka wo transition easy rahega and i realized my audience is on instagram now so i quickly transition and i started making a lot of content here and now here also we are growing and i'm connecting with more and more people and it's amazing yaar ki almost every single day my dms are flooded with new people find uh, like sort of discovering me or finding me on this platform kya re pata hi nahi tha you have an instagram page so i'm connecting with a lot of people and they share just beautiful stories ki are bachpan mein mereko yaad hai i used to come back from school and then i used to watch with my brother i used to watch with my grandmother my dad and all used to watch together so it's just it's just amazing i was back ke wo comments aur ye dms padta rehta hu and um, i get to uh read these beautiful stories and memories and so like there are so many comments asking like are you going to have a comeback journey on the television <laughs> i actually did a com- comeback of sorts um right at the beginning of the pandemic i shot another show uh for disney india uh, called imagine that which was also a uh, a very diy uh upcycling heavy show um and it was great i mean again like i found a new set of audience 
इवन लाइक अलॉट ऑफ पीपल यूज टू वॉच मैन स्पेशली वो कनेक्टेड ऑन इंस्टाग्राम एंड यूट्यूब उन लोगों को पता चला सो दे वॉच द शो एवरी वन लव इट सो आई डिड मेक अटल कम बैक एंड यू नेवर नो क्या होता है नाउ मूव टू गोवा एंड गोवा इज लाइक यू मूव फाइट I want you to get away from the hustle and bustle. So, um, but opportunity, if I do, so definitely I'll do it again. Then we would be uh, very eager to see you on the television very soon. I think. Super. ऐसा opportunity आएगा बनाएंगे आप लोग ऐसे प्यार दोगे तो बनाते रहेंगे. Definitely, sir. And thank you so much, sir, for talking to us about your journey. It was really inspiring, I think, for many people. जैसे आपने बताया that how you started. and the transition that you did from television to uh, social media so thank you so much sir for talking to take one and uh, it's a i i like i said it's a nostalgic moment for me and all the viewers who are watching you right now so thank you so much sir thank you this was great and it's always nice to connect with like i said people who have been part of my journey bahut acha lagta hai and i love this um you know thing about internet ki aap itne sare logon ke sath मिलके उनसे बात कर सकते हो और अपना जर्नी अपने आइडिया शेयर कर सकते हो सो थैंक यू फॉर डूइंग दिस एंड ऑल द बेस्ट यू गाइस एंड एवरीवन हु ट्यून्ड इन थैंक यू सो मच फॉर ऑल द लव एंड या आई एम अराउंड सो किसी को देखना है क्या कर रहा हूं तो फॉलो मी ऑन इंस्टाग्राम और यू कैन कैच माय वर्क ऑन यूट्यूब थैंक यू सो मच सर थैंक यू सो मच बाय गाइज